we might be seeing the United States pulling back from its responsibilities around the world, the beginnings of the disintegration of the European Union. There is a general idea, there has been, that we live in a good world. I see that world eroding a bit. If you go back 30, 40 years, the economics profession thought of itself as something like the physics profession that required that practitioners use advanced mathematics. Math is important for economics, but I think we went too far in that direction. But I think economists are getting better uh, in conveying basic concepts to the public. We've seen a, a, a t increased attention to their ideas. I think economists should be tilting their research more toward the future. We have to be thinking like engineers, uh, that uh, people who design things, and what we're designing is risk management and insurance systems to protect people against uh, the possibility of rising inequality. Most of the rise in inequality that we've seen in, in countries around the world is due to technology. It's not due to uh, anything political. I am really concerned about technological uh, progress replacing jobs. Machines are very reliable for what they do. Um, and humans make mistakes. There would be much more economic inequality if the free market system were less left to its own unregulated devices. That is the big burning issue right now. It's not Donald Trump. Economics profession will, will long into the future be relevant. It's a job that won't be replaced by computers. <laughs>